To enjoy the glow of good health, you must exercise. Every workout counts, even if it's only for 15 minutes. Let's sit in Vajrasana to help you become powerful like a thunderbolt, still and clear like the diamond, and shine your light for all the world to see. A person who sits in Vajrasana cannot easily be shaken. They sit firm in their truth. Vajrasana increases concentration and awakens our compassion. Here's how to do it. You can also start by sitting on all fours. Fold the legs and try to sit on your heels. Keep the big toes touching each other and the knees together. Keep the palms facing down on the thighs. Keep the spine straight. Relax your body. Gaze at a point in front of you and slowly close your eyes. Observe your breath at the tip of your nose. Now slowly open your eyes and see the beauty of this amazing world. Mountain climbers are a total body workout improving cardio endurance, core strength and agility. Plank hip dips strengthen the sides of the lower body. Uh -huh. If you ever find yourself stuck in the middle of the sea I'll sail the world to find you If you ever find yourself lost in the dark and you can't see I'll be the light to guide you Find out what we're made of When we are called to help our friends in need You can't count on me Like one, two, three I'll be there And I know are supposed to do all oh yeah Every day I will remind you, oh, find out what we're made of, when we are called to help our friends in need, you can count on me like one, two, three. Ahimsa for health and wellness. Simply put, treat others the way we want to be treated. The best way to practice Ahimsa is by showing kindness, compassion and love. Strengthen it by exercising every day to make yourself strong and flexible. Help out at home by cleaning up and helping with the household chores. At school, volunteer and help your teachers and friends. Ahimsa in thought, word or deed improves our bodily functions and overall mood. It also makes us strong and independent. So let's get started on that note with our stretches. Sitting on our chairs, spine pulled up, stretch out the hands, raise it to touch the palms, turn the palms, stretch out and bring the hands down. Repeat once more, take the hands up, touch the palms, turn the palms and slowly bring the hands down. For a side stretch, stretch out the right hand and arch to the left side, bring the hand down, take up the left hand and stretch to the right, slowly bring the hand down, repeat, right hand up and stretched to the left, 
left hand up and stretched to the right now let's energize the spine twist to the right hold the stretch a few seconds twist to the left hold the stretch one more time twist to the right and last twist to the left now let's arch the spine back stretch out the hands parallel to the floor arch back bend the head forward and hug yourself tight one more time stretch the hands open parallel to the floor arch back bend the neck in front and hug yourself tight now a good stretch for those hands namaste position push the left palm now push with the right palm repeat once more push the left palm upwards now push the right palm upwards towards the ceiling cross the right ankle over the left knee namaste at the back and slowly bring the chin forward to touch the shin exchange left ankle over the right knee and try to touch the chin to the left leg let's repeat this once more right angle over the left knee bring the chin forward stretch the spine and one more time left ankle over the right knee come forward and try to touch the chin to the leg on top now for the last stretch bring the right knee close to the body as possible and rotate at the ankle two times clockwise two times anti clockwise bring the left knee close to the body rotate the left ankle clockwise and anti clockwise chair yoga also gives you all the health benefits that a normal yoga practice does The benefits include muscle toning, reduced stress levels, better breathing habits, better sleep and an overall sense of well-being. Let's start with the 12 step sequence. Step 1, palms together, forearms parallel to the floor. Step 2, arch back, hands parallel. Step 3, stretch out, bend forward. keep your fingers and toes in one straight line step 4 arch back pull the knees up step 5 knees to forehead step 6 stretch come forward fingers and toes in one straight line step 7 look up arch back step 8 look down once again keeping the spine stretched step 9 once again take the right leg up arch back step 10 forehead to the right knee step 11 stretch up arch back hands parallel step 12 backward rotation of the hands come back to pranamasan now let's repeat the 12 step sequence for the left leg pranamasan palms together stretch up arch back hands parallel stretching forward bring your fingers and toes in one straight line take the left knee up arch back bring the forehead to the knee slowly bring the knee down place the palms next to the feet in one straight line look up arch back Once again look down keep the spine long take the left knee up arch back forehead to the left knee stretch up arch back hands parallel backward rotation come back to the prayer pose now let's do this a little faster pranamasan hands up hands down take the knees up forehead to knees knees down touch the floor look up 
look down once again once again lift the right knee arch back forehead to right knee arch back hands parallel backward rotation pranamasan for the left knee pranamasan stretch up arch back stretching forward touch the floor left knee up arch back forehead to left knee come back down look up arch back look down once again lift the left knee arch back forehead to the left knee stretch up arch back hands parallel backward rotation come back in pranamasan let's be reliable a good friend and be someone to count on let's repeat the stretches and asanas to count on me by bruno mars Ever find yourself stuck in the middle of the sea I'll sail the world to find you If you ever find yourself lost in the dark and you can't see I'll be the light to guide you Find out what we're made of When we are called to help our friends in need You can count on me like one, two, three. I'll be there, and I know when I need it. I can count on you like four, three, two, and you'll be there. 'Cause that's what friends are supposed to do. Oh yeah. Every day I will remind you oh find out what we're made of when we are called to help our friends in need you can count on me like one two three I'll be there and I know are supposed to do oh yeah what friends
things are supposed to do Oh yeah Every day I will remind you, oh, find out what we're made of, when we are called to help our friends in need, you can't count on me like one, two, three, I'll be there, and I know are supposed to do oh yeah Paschim Uttanasan, the favorite posture of all yogis. It not only strengthens the entire body, it strengthens the spine and the abdomen to its maximum. And here's how to do it. Sit up straight with your legs stretched out before you. Keep the spine perfectly erect and the toes flexed towards you. Slowly raise both your arms straight above the head as you stretch up. Now slowly and gently bend forward from the hip joint, keeping your spine erect and moving the chin towards the toes. If you can hold on to the toes, gently pull on them so that you can move forward. Maintain your body in this position for as long as you can. Rise up by stretching your arms up and straight above the head. For spine flexibility, let's reverse the position. Raise the hips in backward plank. Slowly bring the hips down. Relax in the initial posture. Thank you. 